In this video, we will show you how to start working with multi login X. First, on the pricing page, choose a plan that suits you the best and click on the Get Started button. Create a new account and log in to the multi login X web interface. Choose the survey answers that suit you the best. Then click on the Upgrade button. Select View Plans. Choose a plan that suit you the best and proceed to the checkout page to finalize your payment. After completing your payment, click the button Open Multi Login X Web App to start using it. First, connect to the agent. Click on the Agent Disconnected button. Choose the agent that suits your operating system and go to the Downloads folder to find the agent file. Double click on it and follow the on screen instructions to complete the installation. Then click on Connect Agent. Now the agent is connected. Click on the New Profile button to start creating a profile. Give a name to it and choose either Local Storage or Cloud Storage. And go to Next to set up proxy. You can directly configure the multi login proxy as you'll receive 5GB for free after the first purchase. You just need to configure the location, protocol, and sticky sessions, then click Check Proxy. And you can see proxy check passed. Go to the next step, leave all the network settings with default values. Proceed to the next step, leave all hardware settings at their default values, as these configurations are already optimized to generate the fingerprint. Finally, click on Create. Your first profile is successfully created. Click on the Launch button to open the profile. It will automatically download the browser core upon the first profile launch. Now the profile is opened successfully. You will see the public IP address from the proxy, along with other fingerprint details. You can also create and open a new profile and see they have different IP addresses. If you want to use profiles automatically via the API, navigate to the API page on the top, and you'll find comprehensive instructions on how to utilize the API. That's all about how to use Multilogin X. You can find the summary of all steps here. Thank you for watching.